Hello fellow readers, I'm Stephanie and welcome back to my channel. Today I am using my game TBR Tarot to select the books that I am going to read in December. That being said, let's get started! So as you probably saw, what I rolled first was a one. And because I thought it wasn't going to be a ton of fun to watch me just choose one book, I did end up rolling again and I got four. So I will walk through these four selections that I have. The first card that I pulled was a Conqueror of Swords, or also known as the Knight of Swords. This one is going to be a historical fiction or a nonfiction book, and is just going to be whatever first comes up on either my Instagram or Goodreads. The book that I got for this was Last Night at the Telegraph Club. Um, what I know about this book is it is like a historical fiction. I think it is set in the 50s. It is the time period in America where there was the Red Scare. I know it's also like kind of a sapphic romance as well. Um, so like this telegraph club I think is like a lesbian bar or something. And so our two main characters are kind of dealing with a lot in the world at this time. Like both the Red Scare, which our main character is Chinese American as well as queer love isn't really like accepted at this point in time either um, not that it is now necessarily either but you know <laughs> that's what this premise is and as you can see there are a ton of awards over here I have only heard amazing things about this book and so I am so excited to pick this book up and yeah that will be my first selection The next card is a Seven of Coins. Seven is going to be a new author to me, and then the Coins is a thriller or mystery. So for this one, I ended up selecting something that I had on my shelves, which was Confession on the 745. I have definitely never read from this author before, and when I was looking online, I think it had like pretty good reviews so I thought might as well pick it up and get it off my shelves. What I know about this book is like I think this like lady on like a train is just basically like telling a bunch of secrets or something like that like these confessions and like it kicks off this whole mystery and so I am very intrigued to see what this is going to be like. My next card that I pulled was The Star, and this one again is going to be any genre, you know, any book. Um, it just has to have a author of color. And so I very recently learned that there is a, like, holiday themed story written by Talia Hibbert, and that is the author of, like, um, get a life chloe brown and like that brown sisters series and i absolutely love that one book i've been wanting to read more books by her and so i thought this was the perfect excuse to get something a little bit um you know christmasy or like holiday themed in to my tbr so i am so excited to get to this book <laughs> The last card that I pulled was a Seven of Cups. This one again is going to be a new author to me and it will be any romance or contemporary. Similar to the last one, I love reading books that are like on theme for what's happening right now. And a book that I got last year from Book of the Month but never actually finished was The Holiday Swap. To be fair, I don't think I've heard great things about it, but I do own it and I do want to read it. I want this romance. You know, it is an author that I haven't read from before, so I do want to read it. What I know about this book is it has a lot of like baking related stuff. Um, and then as well as we have these two sisters who like swap 
places for like this baking competition and stuff. Um, and then I think what th is going to happen is they're each going to fall in love with like a guy at the opposite like friend or sister spot. Um, so I don't know. It just sounds cozy like it is the hallmark christmas movie vibes that i want um so i am definitely going to pick this up as well so here as well as the last um talia hibbert book are going to be my selection for december like i mentioned i am so excited about like reading some themed books so if you have any suggestions for like winter holiday related books please let me know down below. Until next time, keep reading. Bye!